Hey, what's happening, everybody? Welcome to episode one of the Road to Recovery series. Um, figured I'd make this really to give an in-depth story of everything that happened. Now, to start off, I want to let you guys know what the intention of this whole series was so it won't be confused. I 100% decided to videotape the last four months to really just document and show a really serious time of my life that I was able to face with a smile, honesty, humility, and trust in the process. Um, I really believe that we're gifted these challenges to grow stronger, to forge stronger. And that's what the Spirit of Steel is all about. And I found that this opportunity was so amazingly gifted to me just to prove to myself everything that I talk about, to really live the spirit of steel. Now, this series is going to be four parts. It's going to start off with the beginning, which is actually an injury I had before the major injury. So bear with me. Episode one might be a little slower, but honestly, it's at a time where there's a lot of content in there that I was already going to share with everyone. Um, so you're going to find out a lot of stuff in that one. And then episode two is going to be the pre-surgery and we'll find out about the injury. Episode three <laughs> will uh, be post-surgery and episode four will be the ending and will kind of show a little, you know, surprise challenge that was found through it all. Something else comes up. So I'm really excited for this series. Um, thank you so much just for being a part of this and watching this. And like I said, I really wanted to do this since I did take a full break away these last four months from my own healing. Because, you know, like I always say, you got to respect and love yourself first. I understood that, you know, the wound, the injury is not my fault, but healing is 100% on us. So I really dedicated myself to healing the best I could with the circumstances. So without further ado, here is episode one. I'll be back at the end of it. Thank y'all and let the story begin. What's happening, everybody? Uh, you guys may have been wondering, where has Cold Train been? Well... I may have done something I do a lot, which is took on way too much. I've been trying to run the AC business, which is crazy busy right now, start the new YouTube series, and uh, hit training very hard, and start jujitsu. And I did start jujitsu last week, but unfortunately, I did what I always do. I'm not perfect. I fucked up and I overextended myself. You know, I love to go and hit every day like it's the last day to be alive, but the physical body does have limits as much as that really irks me, and I try to push those limits. But it's all good, we learned a lesson, and like I said, this is a lesson that I have to learn again and again and again. You know, I may have fucked up, but I'm not a fuck up. This is how you learn. But basically, I'm stuck to this chair right now. And I got... This guy. And that guy. So, I'm gonna be stuck in this chair for a little bit. Not gonna lie, in a lot of pain. I personally don't believe in taking pain medication, so uh, that's why my eyes might look a little drowsy and droopy. It's because it's a lot of pain. Um, it's hard to move around. I was able to get in this chair, and now I can move around. But I really want to make this video because there's no excuses. Um, and to look in the positive for this situation is, number one, now I have time to really commit to getting the channel started for YouTube. Um, to anybody that hasn't been around or hasn't heard or wasn't there for the Chrissy podcast, I really want to make that announcement for people who showed up for that is I announced the new 
Cooking with Coltrane series and the Happy Healthy Gaming series, which I've been planning for a very long time. Now, this injury just happened, so we'll see if it's something serious or if it's something, you know, I can heal from very quickly. Luckily, I am very healthy and uh, I do all the necessary precautions every single day to optimize my health and recover as quick as possible. So I'm very optimistic on that. But like I was saying is now I have time more to devote to that, to you guys um, and to be posting on Instagram. So the poster could be coming out of content saved up. Like I said, guys, I was already working on this. I had lots of stuff set up to open up the channel so now I can focus on that. So be ready for tons of content. Um, go follow the YouTube channel. We'll be coming up with cooking vlogs and how to's, both. Um, and let me know how you like them. Also, the other thing is no excuses. Just like I could lay in bed all day and just, you know, watch TV, which I have, you know, I was just watching a Hugh Jackman movie. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. But, um, is we can still get work done. Like I said, you know, we still have this life to live, even with this, you know. We can learn, we can get around it. And what we're gonna do is we're still gonna be cooking today. So even though I'm stuck in this chair, I just wanna show you guys there's no excuses. You can still cook a healthy, delicious meal, even stuck in a chair. For now, we're blessed because like I said, I did have prep, I have this chair. We can still do all that work on the computer. I have lots of food stocked up. Luckily, I was prepared. And uh, that's what I always say and come back to as well, guys, is, uh, that's why preparation is so important for grocery shopping, for your health, for life in general, because you never know what's gonna happen. And that's why I always talk about being the healthiest and strongest and truest expression of yourself you can be. Because you never know what's gonna happen, whether it's you take your last breath or just something serious happens in your life and instead of falling apart, you're there for your family, friends, loved ones, and yourself. And you're able to be present, conscious, learn from it and keep living a happy healthy strong life oh yeah Oh, Shiloh, hello. I have so many friends. Oh, you too? Oh. Mm -hmm. What's happening y'all happy friday yeah 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 it's friday as you guys can see i got the crutch in the background i'm still injured for anybody just tuning in uh i've taken a little hiatus from twitch you know between that the jujitsu and the physical work of ac all day running a business you know it's, and it's hot in florida right now you know peak season it's summer it's uh you know, I haven't had much time. I've kind of, you know, run myself into the ground. Um, but like I said, we learned from that. And it's given me time to actually get this YouTube series started. So many people have been asking about it. I just share the wealth of knowledge and wisdom I've gained over the years through trial of error. Because health and wellness has been really my passion my entire life. And... Uh, 
the Happy Healthy Gaming series is really going to be focused on making y'all the greatest gamers you can be. But not just being the happiest, healthiest, strongest gamer you can be, but also in life as well. So I want to make a dedicated vlog series because I've always loved vlogging. I love how natural and organic and flowing it is like right now. It's just like Twitch. I love live streaming. Um, and really, I will think this is the best way for me to express a lot of great content and value to you guys as well for everything, for cooking, for health. So if you guys have any questions at all, send them at me. Or uh, for cooking with Coltrane, I actually have a good amount of content already filmed on that. Um, if you guys don't already follow the Instagram, I'll put a little handle right here. Um, follow it now. Um, I would follow the Twitch as well. It's all SS Coltrane. Hey, I'm doing some self-healing. Um, the meditate, like I said, the meditation, the healthy eating, all the things I do does keep my body optimal. Um, and I do he heal very quickly. And I've been experiencing that so far. You know, I went from not being able to get out of bed to now being able to go through a full physical work day. Um, even though I still was keeping the weight on the one leg. So uh, hopefully we get the training stream soon, the game streams as well that everyone has been asking about. I love gaming with y'all. Um, so I'm gonna keep on working on healing. Uh, they keep on working on the YouTube, try to get all this content out to y'all as soon as possible. And uh, if you guys like this video, don't forget to smash that like button. Also subscribe. Um, we're gonna be building this channel now from the ground up and we're gonna keep on going like i said ton of content this is gonna be a long journey so i would love to have you along for the ride all right i've taken up enough of your time like i said tgif cheers y'all love you it's cold train
wow. <laughs> so, uh, watching that now that, uh, you know, that was August 25th. So, uh, it's been a good five months almost now since that. And just some of the things that were said, the foreshadowing is just, it's, it's just like dramatically hilarious. Like it couldn't have been set up better. Um, like I said, I was at, you know, the height, I had just put a post of being in the best shape of my life for my birthday. And I was really proud of that achievement. Um, busiest time of the year for the brand new business, uh, training jujitsu, you know, adding a lot of things, planning the new YouTube series. It was full steam ahead for the coal train. <laughs> and, uh. Then life decided to smack me in the face. But like even the introduction of that on the initial injury, uh, the bit about, you know, we're gifted these challenges and to be prepared for them. Like, like I said, I, I a hundred percent believe we're gifted these challenges and it's almost like, you know, this was the perfect time for me to get it as well. Um, so like I said, stick around. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you found some value in it. And subscribe and share it with anybody else. Because the whole point of this whole video series is really after this crazy 2020 that we all had. Um, is just, uh, you know, share this story with you. And let you know if you're having a hard time as well that you're not alone. You know, I'm out there here fighting too. And if you are having a really hard time out there, know it does get better. Um, I was in some pretty dark times during uh, this story. And I thought the light wasn't going to shine again, but it did. And I just had to work through it, breathe through it, and uh, stick to my heart. So thanks again, y'all. Having a wonderful rest of your day. Cold train out. See you on the next episode.